Hi everyone, on this topic, I will talk about Delta DMV VGR MOBAS TCP communicate with the ASPOC system architecture. We will use the DMV VGR as a, a MOBAS TCP a client, or we can say master and POC will be server. Okay, and DMV VGR basically will offer three days of free trial, so you can download from Delta official website. And DMV VGR basically we need to install on the IPC. Uh, with a better uh, with the PoE uh, port and POC IP address we remain a uh, default IP address uh, so it will be a uh, 0.1.5 and today's example we would use the uh, detect a uh, delta triangle position and then send this uh, x y and theta position to POC uh, let's move to the VGR setting so first of all here we will go to the login and select the manager uh, with the password uh, 2222 okay next uh, we will go to the uh, flow setting so first uh, for the camera we will use the virtual uh, camera as example because we will import the uh, photo over here and next we will add on the shape okay and after that uh, we can set the flow chart and then you will pump out this uh, uh, these uh, procedures and you, if you see the, this uh, ex mark that means uh, the setting is not yet finished and after that we uh, click the camera and go inside to import the photos that we want to uh, process and next uh, you can see the procedure here will become uh, three means a uh, shape so uh, the red one means a uh, uh, ROI uh, region and then uh, here uh, for the blue one is uh, for the patterns parameters and uh, because we want to count uh, five uh, triangles, so here we modify the value to five. And the last step is uh, the output means the information we want to send to POC. So first of all, here we will modify the mobile address to zero, means this will equal to a POC uh, data range just D0, okay? And then you can edit uh, the information that you want to show an example here we want to check the x y and theta uh, information of for the triangle so this one we just uh, add on this uh, step by step so eventually we'll show over here and then we can click uh, finish so how about if we want to show the information on the VGR so basically uh, we just go to man manage and then here you can click the display settings and then again uh, you just uh, select the shape x y and theta so after that, uh, we have to uh, go to the communication settings and then uh, go to the MOBAS and select a MOBAS TCP client. And here we will assign a POC IP address, then uh, click connect. So after that, we uh, switch the VGR to uh, run mode and then trigger. So you will detect the and show the XY information. Then you can uh, compare these two values uh, from uh, VGI and the POC will be exactly the same. Okay, so now if we uh, move to the VGI parts and then uh, log in with uh, 2222. And next we click the flow chart and here uh, modify from uh, Gigi to virtual. And then we will find the shape. Okay, and uh, add on. Okay, and then we set the flow and again here you see the exclamation mark so uh, we just click inside and then uh, scroll down and to add the photo that we want to add on so today we will add on uh, two photos first is uh, this one and then second is a uh, rotate the photo okay so now we will move to next step so this one is uh, to define the ROI and patterns. So uh, the red one is the ROI, okay? And if you feel this one is not that easy to uh, modify because this uh, has have a slightly angle. Okay, so we can uh, go back to the previous uh, step. So now we can uh, move this one up. Okay, then we can go back. Okay, and then uh, we can go to the parameters and then uh, we can move this one okay. and then uh, we can go to the target count and modify to 5 
okay and set and then to the final step uh, so here if you remember we will need to modify the address to uh, zero and then we will click and add on the output so we want to check the uh, triangle uh, x y uh, and theta position so now uh, we add on the x uh, y and theta and then uh, we select the second one also add on the x y uh, theta then change to the third one the fourth and the fifth the last one okay so after we add on this this will auto update here then uh, we can click uh, finish and uh, if you want to uh, show the information then we can go to here and select add then uh, use the, again for the shape and x okay then uh, y and theta so uh, here just uh, use uh, this three uh, as the example so you will see the x y theta and okay then if you want to see more then you need uh, to uh, pay uh, some effort so again and now we use the two and then I will switch to the ISP shop so basically okay create then now we create the empty program then here uh, for the uh, device monitor table uh, we create a new one and then uh, check uh, D0 and 20 device and for sure before online uh, basically you need to uh, set up the communication settings to select the driver and after that you have to go here and check the connection status uh, if everything is uh, good then we can switch online so you will see now all the information is zero and then we will go back to the uh, DMV VGR and then uh, go to the MOBAS then here is uh, for the MOBAS uh, TCP client then we set the POC IP address then uh, click connect and next step is uh, we will switch to uh, ROM mode and then we can uh, click this one to trigger so we will see this is the information and we can compare the value in the ISP shop so you can see this one is a S7985 okay then this one is a 131624 okay. then we will uh, trigger the second one so you will see the first one the value is a 498506 okay and then next uh, for the Y position is a 98 sorry N9507. Uh, uh, so that's all for uh, today's topic. Thank you.